Jonathan's ready, so is Chuck, so is Scott. John, we'll start with you. What do you say? Yemen. Yemen. What do you think, Scott? Jordan. Jordan. What do you think, Chuck? I said Oman. Oman. The answer we're looking for is Yemen. Nice job. Jonathan? <laughs> Okay, so Jonathan, you have 85, Scott, you have 70, Chuck, you have 70. For our next clue, we go to Acme Fangnet. Top grunge sneezed into the rainforest south of Yucatan, where my friend Fair de Lance, the viper, lives. Old Fair bit him, but Fair was the one who got poisoned. Next, grunge went to Belmopan, the capital's city and then he moved off the coast to the keys where he fit right in with the brown footed boobies the stupidest birds in the world okay guys name the country is it nicaragua belize or honduras remember the clues that we heard south of yucatan capital is belmopan and keys off off the coast everybody's ready john we'll start with you what do you say belize belize what do you think scott Belize. Belize. What do you think, Chuck? Belize. Belize. The answer we're looking for is Belize. Nice job, everybody. Okay, so Jonathan, you have 95. Scott, you have 80. Chuck, you have 80. I'll tell you guys, this is not an easy case. And whenever I'm in a situation like this, I always look over here to Agnes Acme, the founder of Acme Crime Net and the Chief's great-grandmother. She always knows. I wonder sometimes what she'd do right now. Well, I wouldn't be staring at an old portrait. I'd get off my duff, sniff out that felon. He drove his Winnebago to Lake Winnebago, picked up a pair of overalls in Oshkosh, and then crossed to La Crosse. Now get out there! Get him! Thanks, Agnes. Okay, guys, name the state. Is it Michigan, Wisconsin, or Minnesota? Remember the clues that we heard? Lake Winnebago, Oshkosh, and La Crosse. Put the evidence together, come up with an answer. Everybody's there. John, we'll start with you. What do you say? I'll try Minnesota. Minnesota. Scott. Minnesota. Minnesota. Chuck. I'll say Minnesota. Minnesota. The answer we're looking for is Wisconsin. <laughs> Sorry, guys. Not to worry, though. Jonathan, you still have 95. Scott, you have 80. Chuck, you have 80. Now it's time for the final clue of this round, fellas. You have to decide now how much you want to risk. If you're right, we'll add that amount to your score. If you're not right, we'll subtract it from your score. You can risk 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, or 50 Acme Crime Bucks. Take a look right over here, if you will, please, gentlemen. Here is the, are the possible locations where we think Top Grunge is headed. Now, if you know a lot about this part of the world, you may want to risk a lot. If you don't know very much about it, though, you may not want to risk quite so much. So, take a look at the map and think about it. Okay, guys, look like everybody has uh, come up with an answer. Now it's time to go to our last clue. We have a report now from Acme Ballnet. Take it away, Agent Dan Plesak. Top Grunge is in the city where they hold the Little League World Series. Makes sense. There are two National League teams in the same state, along with the international headquarters for Pony League Baseball. Okay, thanks, Dan. Guys, name the city. Is it Baseball City, Florida, East St. Louis, Illinois, or Williamsport, Pennsylvania? Remember the clues that we heard? Little League World Series. Two National League teams, international headquarters for Pony League Baseball. Come up with an answer, lay it down right there in front of you. Chuck, sorry, so is Scott, so is Jonathan. Chuck, we're going to start with you. You have 80 crime bucks. First of all, before you show us your answer, how much did you risk? I risked 30. 30. If you're right, you'll go in the lead. What'd you say? I said Williamsport, Pennsylvania. Williamsport is right. Nice job, Chuck. Takes up to 110, you're in the lead. Scott, you also had 80 crime bucks. How much did you risk? 50 crime bucks. 50 crime bucks. You'll take the lead if you're right. What'd you say? Williamsport, Pennsylvania. Nice job, pal. Okay. Takes up to 130. Jonathan, you have 95. How much did you risk, pal? I risked zero. Zero. Took it the safe way out. Okay. If you're right or wrong, Scott and Chuck are still going to go into the ne uh, to the next round. But what'd you say? Baseball City. Baseball City. Doesn't matter. You stay at 95. Scott and Chuck, you're going to the next round. Nice job, guys. Jonathan, listen, man, you were a great detective. You did some great stuff for us today. We've assembled a kit that's going to help you in your next case. Chief. It's the official Acme Crime Net Travel Kit, and it includes a World Traveler's Atlas, an official Carmen watch, a Carmen sweatshirt, and a subscription to National Geographic World Magazine. And our thanks for all your good work on this case. And Jonathan, I salute you. Thanks, Chief. Okay, guys, now it's time for you to go to Pennsylvania. You're going to try to track down Top Grunge and the pipeline. What you have to do is find them, bring them back but I want you to know, we do not send our agents out into the field unprepared. Chief, how about a briefing? Top 
Chuck Grunge was last seen in Williamsport, Pennsylvania, but he could be anywhere in the state by now. So here's the scoop on the Keystone State. Founded by William Penn, 1681, state birds the ruffed grouse. Major industries include agriculture, coal mining, and tourism. Population around 12 million. The boys down at Photo Recon have put together a few slides. Pittsburgh, where the Allegheny and the Monongahela rivers meet. Center of the steel industry, Pittsburgh was named most livable city in the U.S. a few years ago. Head to Scranton and check out Steamtown. Commemorates the history of steam railroads in America. Search the 19th century train. Now, top grunge may seek refuge in the uh, coal car. The battlefield at Gettysburg, site of some of the Civil War's worst fighting. Confederate General Robert E. Lee attacked the Union Army here. President Lincoln gave his Gettysburg address in honor of those who fell for the Union's victory. Amish country. Most Amish refuse to use modern technology, preferring a traditional lifestyle. Known as the Pennsylvania Dutch region, but the people aren't Dutch. The German settlers' word for themselves, Deutsch, was misunderstood and the mistake stuck. Independence Hall, Philadelphia. Declaration of Independence was signed here 1776. Constitution was signed here 1787. Alaska pipeline's been stashed here 1990. Well, that last one was just a hunch, so check it out. Anyway, that's Pennsylvania. Gumshoes. It's time to head out into the field now. And always remember the Acme Triangle of Excellence. Vigilance, dedication, courage. Go get them, gumshoes! <laughs> Okay guys, here we are in Pennsylvania, set your stuff down here, take a walk right over there, let me show you what we have. Here are the locations where you might be able to find top grunge, the pipeline, and a warrant for grunge's arrest. Now the first thing you have to do is find the loot. Once you have that, then you can get a warrant. With the warrant, you then can arrest the crook. Now, uh, connect all three of those in that order, in, that, in, in a single turn, and you get a chance to try to catch Carmen San Diego. Catch Carmen San Diego, and you get that trip to anywhere in the lower 48 United States. Now, one more thing. You can pick any one of these locations that you want to, but if you happen upon the loot, the warrant, or the crook, you get a free turn, okay? So, Scott, you were ahead at the end of the last round. You go first. Veteran Stadium. Veteran Stadium. Nothing there? Okay, Chuck. Independence Hall. Independence Hall. Nope, oh, sorry, nothing there. Go ahead, Scott. Hershey Park. Hershey Park. Nope, nothing there. Chuck? Temple University? Temple University. The warrant. Okay, you got the warrant. Remember, you have to get in the right order, though. Loot, warrant, and crook. Go ahead, Chuck. Dickens College? Dickens College. Dickens. Nothing there. Dickens College. Okay. Scott, go ahead. Valley Forge. Valley Forge. Nothing there. Chuck? Downtown Scranton? Downtown Scranton. Top Grunge! There's Top Grunge. Remember the way you have to do it. Loot, warrant, crook. Go ahead. Frick Art Museum? Frick Art Museum. Nothing there. Scott, go ahead. Downtown Scranton. Downtown Scranton. Top get a free turn, go ahead. Temple University. Temple University. The warrant. Okay, remember, you have to get the loot, the warrant, and the crook. Right now, you're going the opposite direction. Use some strategy. Go ahead. Betsy Ross House. Betsy Ross House. Nothing there. Okay, Chuck, go ahead. Germantown. Germantown. Unctuous pipeline. There is the loot. Go ahead, Chuck. Temple University. Temple University. The Need one more. Do you remember where Top Grunge is? Downtown Scranton. Downtown Scranton. Yeah! Okay, come here, Chuck. Nice job, pal. Very nice job. Come right over here. You got Top Grunge. Now all you have to do is put him in jail, pull on that chain, and do it. Okay, Chuck, look, now uh, we're going to talk about your next adventure in just a little bit, but first, Scott, you were a great detective, man. You tracked Top Grunge all the way to Pennsylvania. we got some great stuff for you. Chief? We have a world band radio so that Scott can listen to broadcasts from all over the world. Nice work, Scott. Okay, Chuck, look, a little, have a little paperwork for you to do, as most detectives do. Inside of this piece of paper and a pen, what I want you to do is write down where you'd like to go if you catch Carmen San Diego and get that trip. Do it. Okay, nice job, dude. You got top grunge, you got the pipeline, right? That's not bad. The only, there's only one more thing left to do, and that's get Carmen San Diego. Hold on a second. Can you hold this for me? Can you get this for you? 
Hello? Hello? Yeah, he's right here. It's for you, Chuck. Hello? Uh, it's a dirty trick, me being at the joint and Carmen on the loose. <laughs> Look for her in Africa. Achoo! Looks like you and I are going to Africa. 